Tracy Sahuri, the principal of Creekside Elementary in Heartland, has been ticketed by Argentine Township Police for hosting a party where minors drank alcohol. It happened here at her home on 14 acres July 9th. Sahuri and her husband, Rayad, hosted a graduation party, and it led to an evening bonfire. Sahuri's husband called police and emergency crews when his 16-year-old girl started vomiting from too much alcohol. If it was another household, we came there and we had an unresponsive female, which uh, the 16-year-old was transported to the hospital and treated and released. If we investigate the same circumstance, we would issue again. After the investigation, the Sahuris were both given tickets for misdemeanors. The officer who investigated found that there were coolers filled with alcohol. The young woman who got sick reportedly admits to police to drinking Jägermeister beer and vodka. Witnesses told police that both the Sahuris were aware the teens were drinking. It appears that the, uh, there was probable cause to believe that, that the parents knew that their alcohol it was. It would be very hard for me to believe that they didn't know that there was alcohol being uh, uh, consumed. No one was answering at the home today. The Heartland Consolidated Schools is now investigating whether Sahuri should face disciplinary action. The ticket is a misdemeanor, punishable by up to 30 days in jail and or a $1,000 fine. The Sahuri's attorney denies that his clients did anything wrong. He claims they took action immediately when they found out the teens had alcohol. And I think they did all the right things. They, you know, they contacted the police. They tried to contact the parents. They took the alcohol from the kids. And they never allowed the alcohol at the house. Scott Van Epps, the assistant superintendent, told me today that he hopes to have the investigation into possible disciplinary action against Tracy Sahuri completed by the time the school year begins. In Heartland, I'm Mary Conway, Channel 7, Action News. And Mary tells us the principal and her husband have been given notices now to appear in court on August 8th.